Welcome back, Super Metroid. We're about to do some backtracking, but only just a little bit. It's going to be like fancy backtracking. Let me show you. So you bomb here, and you just keep bombing. Now we've done this before, but generally, Super Metroid does backtracking right. And I'm going to show you why. It's going to make you feel powerful. We went down here before. This time we're going to go this way. You just go. We ain't got time for nothing down there. Now we just picked up the fancy boots. Here they are. This room may look familiar. There it is. Finished the loopy loop. We hit them with a casual save good stuff now if you remember there's a room up here that we were not fast enough to get through well guess what now we are whoops the vertical jumping very difficult for me all right hit him with those fancy boots you got love to see it now we'll need to come back here later with some super bombs is that even what they're called I don't think they're called super bombs. They might be. But we'll have to come back here. Very important. Don't dip on me. He dipped on me. He dipped on me again. I should get you a little circle going around here. The walls have faces. Nothing new. Alright, this is not where we go yet. You do a little loop to loop here. Ow. They just kinda ganged up on me there. Didn't didn't notice their presence. It's fine. You got the ice beam. We're gonna slow things down. We're gonna get chill in here. That kind of thing. We got fancy sparkles now, snowflakes, that kind of thing going on. Good stuff. We'll have to go ahead and loop to loop again. But this time we'll freeze the eerie faces of the walls. We are gaining in power daily. Kind of like if we were working out. I don't do that. Sometimes I do that, just not very often. Let me show you what you do, boys. Right there it is. Good stuff. Ow. It's not how you're supposed have I messed up? I have messed up. That didn't go the way it was planned to go. Neither did that. Whatever, just go. I, I kind of did it right, but then I didn't. Alright. We got the falling feet going on here. Ow. Alright, we just do a little circle. Now. A little more backtracking. It's a good kind of backtracking. We're going to go back to Red Bren Star. We're going to freeze some beetles and we're going to climb on their backs. We're going to ascend to heaven. Casually. It's beautiful game map here. Beautiful backtracking, interconnectivity. One of the better game worlds, the best game world of retro times in my book. Well, at least that I'm familiar with. I mean, there are games that I haven't played, of course. But a uh, big fan of the Met Super Metroid world. I think a lot of people are. I think it's one reason that it has gained the kind of popularity that it has over the years. You know, we got your speedrunning crew. You can just uh, kind of do it any way you want. And people love that kind of thing. Almost as much as I love you, dear viewer. I don't think that's what I was supposed to do. I may have made a slight miscalculation. We'll just have to wait here for a moment. It'll allow us time to bond. Love to see it. Oh no, please, please game. Okay, game. Okay. I'm gonna. You see how I game? Uh, blame the game there. 
because it was clearly a fault. All right, all right. It's hard jumping, man. What the hell, dude? All right, now now I'm getting annoyed. The jump is super floaty but super stiff at the same time. If you've played it, I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. And if you haven't played it, like it's like, what are you doing? Are you dumb? I sure you, I'm a little bit dumb, but it's mostly the game. I think it's, it's probably not actually the game. It's probably just me. Don't open that up. There's a fierce beast inside. Uh, okay. You never know what'll come out of there. This is a spot we could not jump up earlier. Traversed. Oh God, this is my one weakness. My one weakness, jumping. And I just keep playing platformers. It's fine. It's fine. If you can't do it, do it till you can. Okay. Hardest part of the game. Defeated. Great video so far, right? Now one of these is fancy. You can go down it. We're not going to try those. I don't think it's in this room. You shouldn't just try going down random beasts throats that want to kill you that came out awkward just never mind I believe this is where we need to be slug beasts only a little awkward I called them power super bombs earlier they're actually referred to as power bombs and we're about to get them ow all right, this was why you don't go in here. You get chewed on. I, I make everything more difficult than it has to be. Why do I do this? Just entertainment value, baby. Is it really, though? Who knows? You got your power bombs on now. It opens up a lot of the map. You just go ahead and try them out right here. See that? That's called exploration. It's a beautiful thing. Now, is this the one I need to go through? Nope, it is not. One of these you can just uh, power bomb through, or you just you just go through it. I don't remember what it is. I think it's just missiles that you get anyway, so it's no big deal. But it does happen. I didn't make it up. Like I said, the power bombs open up a lot of the map. We'll be doing some of that. So you can't even go back this way without the power bombs. Now, do I need to go back that way? I don't quite remember. Actually, you know, I don't really remember where I need to go right now. I'll have to look at the map for a second. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. You go back to the... Uh, the fancy boots room where we had to run through. I do remember getting stuck here for quite a while. Because that's not really something that would stick out in your head, I don't think. Now, if you go up here, it goes back up towards our spaceship. I don't think we need to go there right now. But it is a nice little loop around. Take them out, boys. Ow. All right, this is what I was thinking of. I think. We'll see. Yeah, I knew it was somewhere. And it's very useful to have another stack of power bombs. So, glad I recalled that. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, uh, these are kind of murder rooms. A bunch of little spikes and stuff going on. I don't remember if we actually need to go up here or not. There might be stuff. Let's go ahead and take a little detour and see what I'm talking about here. I might be a little crazy.
Alright, powerbomb.com. Don't go there. Similar enemies to what you're used to seeing with, but they're just a little bit different. Those are a little bit easier to deal with. Now, right goes to new stuff, if I believe correctly. Don't think we really need to go right just yet. We can't even go right because we need a grappling hook. But once we get a grappling hook, you know where we're coming back. Good stuff. I think there's a couple more of those in here. Alright, going left, we'll go ahead and make another big fancy loopy loop. Does this look familiar? Okay, messed up the whole thing. Really? Alright, let's try it again. You're supposed to be able to run through that. Maybe you have to do it from the other side. A little embarrassed, but only a little bit. Alright. Our spaceship is mere moments away. Do we need to go to it? No, not really. But I'm going to just because it's cool. There it is, boys. We'll get the we'll get the fancy save, the replenishment. Gives you all your missiles and junk back. Love it. Would like to have some more super missiles. It's odd that we have more power bombs than super missiles. I may have missed some. Certainly a possibility. But now you hit him with the run. Okay. Let's try it again. Now you hit him with the run. Alright, good. Looks like I know what I'm talking about sometimes. But, you know, it's like a 10% rate. I'll take it. I think it's pretty cool. I can just loop right back to the start of the game. Kind of a waste of time for what we were doing. But we'll take it. Alright, where was my little drop off? Was this it? Yeah. Okay. So we're just going to go right back down. Not much point in doing what I just did, but you know, it gives us time to bond. And that's the most important thing. Now we will continue our route to progression. We gotta go back to Norfair, if I can recall how to get there. Thank you. Now let's look at this fancy map here. I need to go to Norfair, so do we just go right? We just go straight back down and go right, right? Now we can do this big chunk of uh, blue down there in the middle. I think we need the grappling hook first though. I think we can do some of it, but we might as well um, wait to do it, I believe. Kind of like the other place. You might as well. Just... Do I have to go this way? Okay, I do. Yeah, okay. So, this is another little choke point that it won't let you back out of until you actually get the super missiles. Or the power bombs, rather. Getting my ammunition confused here. Happens to the best of us. Oh my god, this hell room, man. I just do it for um, viewer engagement. It's easy to get knocked into the, the unforgiving mouth of justice. I mean, I didn't really mean to do it three times. Actually, I didn't mean to do it any, but you know, we'll just ignore that part. Okay, so you go all the way back down this tower. The red tower of Brinstar, as some may say. We climbed all the way up there for some power bombs. Was it worth it? Some may say it was. Some may say it wasn't. Who am I to judge? Um, probably should get that. Uh, we'll go left maybe later. It's for an optional item, like a x-ray looking thing. You can get that and it'll help you through some tough spots. Really kind of a hassle to get. I don't know for sure if we're going to or not. I have died trying to get it before because it's, you know, a hassle. I think there's some other stuff we get down there. So I might try to do it. No promises, of course. Okay, I gotta do a better jump than that, apparently. Please. Oh, God. Alright, hit him with one of these. Okay, never mind. Run, try. Hit him with one of these. 
What have I done? Have I forgotten how to play the game? You gotta do the run. That's what that is. Okay, you gotta just do the run, boys. I didn't look like a fool for nothing. Am I going the right way? Absolutely. Really easy to get turned around. Especially when you have so much of the map open now. And with the uh, power bombs. After we get the grappling hook, which will be soon-ish, there's a lot of backtracking we could get for more energy tanks and super missiles. I'm not sure how much of that I'll do. I probably need the energy tanks. When you fight um, Ridley, big dragon boy from the beginning, he's kind of hard to fight, so you need the items and the energy tanks to do it. At least I do. Hit him with the speed booster. Alright, told you we'd be back here soon enough. It's all good stuff. These fire dwelling beasts can no longer handle my freeze ray. Thank you. Probably could just run through here just as easily. Didn't hit a single thing there. My my memory is a little cloudy past this point, or even up to this point. Like, I don't remember exactly where I need to go. Like, I remember bits and pieces of it, but that's about it. Alright, I think we need the speedy boys going on here. Love to see it. Alright, so... I know if we go up, it'll connect us to some other stuff. And down, well, that's a secret. I don't remember where this goes. I think it's like an optional thing. All kinds of options, as we had discussed. I guess that's an energy thing. Alright, you need the grapplies for this. I don't remember if that's actually an item or if it just loops back to uh, the other part. Do I remember what was up here? I think the real secret is I just need to come back here in a second. Not what I need to do. Please go. Don't remember the last time we saved. I think we can go up here and do it though. Just for the in cases. Don't really want to get, you know, knocked back forever. Yeah, I mean it's it's worth the extra time to go do it. out pumpkin cactus man all right you get the soupy and you shoot it what is this foul beast you say you have to back him to lava he's impervious to damage Let him get ahead of you because he'll knock you into the lava. Shoot him right in the mouth, boys. We gotta use some soupies on him. Oops. Not ideal. He's trying to get up in my space. We ain't gonna let him. There ain't no get up in my space. This could be a hard fight. I don't know. I've never failed at it. I 
And there he goes. Gruesome metal death. Especially for a Super Nintendo game. Kind of, you know, might give you some nightmares. That's okay, though. Ow. What's happening? Oh, no. It's the Crocomire risen from the dead. Just kidding, though. I think that's a nice touch. It gives you like the, you've killed the boss, but then not really, but then really. I like to see that, it's a good thing. Boss could be a little spicy probably, not sure. Okay, hit him with the, the save point. All right, now hit him with the next time. Love you, miss you. See you then.